I'm Tanya Van Court. I'm the CEO and founder of Goalsetter. Goalsetter is a next generation fintech platform made, made just for the next generation. When I say investing in assets for your kids, what do you think of? My guess is that the majority of you think of a mutual fund or an IRA perhaps, and very few of you think of this. But between the ages of zero to 12, the average American kid receives $6,617 worth of toys. And two out of three moms say that their kids have too much stuff. Too much stuff in spite of the fact that 83% of American parents can't afford important goals like college for their kids. So the question is, how do we transform money spent on meaningless goods into money saved for meaningful goals? The answer is Goal Setter. With Goal Setter, we let young people sign up for goals that are important to them instead of receiving more goods that aren't in three big categories, saving for the future, like a computer or college fund, sharing with others, whether that's endangered animals or the environment, and spending on things or experiences that really matter to them, like summer camp or music classes. Parents can auto-save weekly or monthly to help save for big goals over time. Friends and family can use birthdays and holidays to give real money towards real dreams instead of buying more gift cards that get lost and are never used. And kids can watch their savings grow and learn that good things really do come to those who save. Goal Setter combines the best of gift-giving platforms like Zola that are redirecting money away from traditional gifts and goal-setting and savings platforms like Acorns and Capital that let people save small amounts towards big goals. And in so doing, we are giving the $54 billion spent on more kids' stuff every year a meaningful place to go into an FDIC-insured account with Goal Setter. We are already resonating with moms across the country. We've decreased our uh, cost per acquisition to $2.50, and our lifetime value is over $100 because moms are telling us that they want to engage with us in multiple ways. 50% want to auto-save towards their own kids' goals. 70% want to give a goal card as opposed to a gift card to other kids in their lives. And almost 90% want to share their kids' profiles with family and friends, inviting even more transactions across our platform and simultaneously spreading the word. Speaking of spreading the word, Dave & Buster's is one of the largest party providers in the country, and they prominently feature Goal Setter on their national party landing page. There's no team better than ours to make Goal Setter a reality in all American households. I formerly led digital products for preschool and parenting at Nickelodeon, and I'm an alumni of Stanford. The rest of our team has an amazing set of backgrounds with moms, fintech, and technology. We are Team Goal Setter. Our goal for today was to get you excited about how we're changing financial health for the next generation of family and kids. Thank you. This is, this is great. Um, your slide that had the three diagrams there implied you're gonna be a platform in the middle. And I imagine you'll choose to build some features yourself and then other features you'll choose partners. How do you, how do you think about what you're gonna put in the platform versus where you wanna partner? Sure. Uh, we think about ourselves as a platform that really engages kids and families in a way that no other platform has. So the things that we elect to build are the things that are deeply engaging kids and families. From a FinTech perspective, we are partnering with fantastic partners like Synapse Pay as an example that are helping to fuel all of the back-end FinTech um, components that we are launching that are consumer-facing. So what would you say is the core feature of the platform you've built right now? So a core feature of the platform is um, uh, that we built or that we're partnering on. Okay, yeah, absolutely. So a core feature, a feature of the product that we've built is the goal-based savings module. So what we do is we let kids sign up for their goals. It's really fun to pick your goals. You can easily share those goals with friends and family. So it's the engagement around goals. Um, and it's also selecting goals in multiple categories. So saving, sharing, and spending. So we offer up and recommend goals in the sharing category as an example because kids might not know what causes they really care about. So we've recommended goals for causes that, that would be exciting to kids. Sure. You seem to be focused mostly on the saving. I think there's a lot more money in the spending, uh, especially as kids get older. Um, so what age group are you really targeting? Are you targeting the sort of grammar school? Or, you know, with high school, it changes, and they start spending on dates and food and movies and that 
Absolutely. Uh, what we've seen is that about 30% of our parents have kids that are between zero and four years old. About 50% have kids that are between five and seven years old. And then about 70% have kids that are between eight and 12 years old. I know those numbers don't add up. It's because parents have multiple kids, right? So, so we've seen zero to 12 is the primary sweet spot in terms of the kids who are on the platform. How many moms, how many kids... And what's the average amount that uh, is being targeted for savings and percentage funded? I know it's a bunch of different numbers. Let's start with how many moms and how many kids so far? Yeah, so we just launched in beta about 30 days ago. We've already added about 1,000 moms to the platform. And again, that's at a cost per acquisition of about $2.50. Um, each of those moms has about two kids. So on average, we're seeing about 2,000 kids for the 1,000 moms. Um, and in terms of savings across the platform, we are asking people to sign up for autosave, and we're recommending $30 per month per, per family, and we're seeing somewhere between $10 and $25 per month that people are signing up for for autosave. Quick question on the business yeah. model. How do you guys make money? The great thing about us, because we uh, look like both Zola and we look like Acorns, is that we can monetize the platform in both ways. So from a gift-giving perspective, we charge 5% for every gift that's given across the platform. And from an autosave perspective, we charge not only $1 per month, $1 per month per kid that you're autosaving for. So we have the uh, ability to monetize um, two kids or three kids or four kids. And, and we've talked to lots of moms who have said, that makes perfect sense to me and works for me. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you.